Let's talk about our immune system a little bit. What's the best way to boost that? I have a cold. I should have done that a while ago, but yes. what's the best way to yeah. do that? Yeah, it's, uh, the immune system is an interesting thing. Um, let's go back to stress. Okay. If you're under stress, you know, your body is just not going to be able to repair itself as fast as if you were, you know, relaxing the body because you have two different systems in the, in the body, a sympathetic and a parasympathetic. One reacts to stress and rebuilds the body. The other one is more of a, a relaxation state. So trying to balance those two systems in the body. So you, you have to reduce the stress in the body. And let's go back to the different types of stress. So we're talking about the emotional, mental stress, mm -hmm. physical stress, more importantly, biochemical stress. So what we want to do is we want to try to get the garbage out of the body and try to get the good stuff in. And why some people get sick faster or uh, some people heal faster than others has a lot to do with this balance, input and output of nutrients versus chemicals. And um, if you have a toxic load in your body, you know, your body's trying to process this. And all of a sudden it gets, mm -hmm. it's trying to fight something else, trying to fight a cold, trying to fight a, a virus, a bacterial infection. It's got a lot going on. Uh, versus someone else that doesn't have a heavy toxic load. Now they can use those nutrients really to fight off the bacteria and the viruses. So really comes to input and output uh, with some of these biochemical things that we're exposed to every day and then trying to get nutrients into the body. So if you can boost your immune system through trying to reduce some stress, mental, emotional stress, hydrate yourself, and try to get lots of nutrients into the body, particularly mm -hmm. vitamin C because that helps your liver detoxify itself.